morning, boys and girls. Once again, welcome to Power Kids. Here is Teacher McKenna and Teacher Sam. Yes. Very ready to represent Bible lesson, Bible story to learn all of us. Our dear parents, we love you. Listen with us. Learn with us, and God is going to bless us together. Yeah. Uncle Sam, yeah. today is another day yeah. that the Lord has made. True. We have to rejoice in it. Rejoice we in have to rejoice in, in it, it because our Lord has given us a new day. Yes. Can we pray so that we learn the Bible story? Wow. We close our eyes. We bow our hands for the word of prayer. Heavenly Father, Thank you for loving us, boys and girls, and our parents as teachers, and in giving us another opportunity to be in your presence. Always we are ready to hear your word, teachers, Father, because by ourselves we are not able. But when you allow your spirit to teach us, we are going to learn from you. We are going to grow in your ways all days long. Yeah. This is the prayer of faith. In Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Can you say amen together, boys and girls? Amen. amen. Saying amen is say, let it be. Oh, yes. Is it? It is true. Now we agreed the word of God is true and it percent. The promises of God are yes and amen. Oh, yes. Can I remind you what we have been learning in couples of Saturdays? We have been learning God is our victor. That tells you we are not alone. Mm -hmm. God is our victor. Our victor. He is going to give us victory. Victory. You know, I know you want to be a big boy. Mm -hmm. uh, you want to be a president of Kenya. Mm -hmm. You want to be a big person. Mm -hmm. God is going to enable you to be all that. Very true. But now today, we are doing a story of Bible to learn from the Bible. Yes, yes. We can have victory. Victory. Because we said our guide is Bible. Bible is the word of God. Bible is good. You read the Bible every day. You pray every, every day. day. Yes. Now, we are saying, <laughs> mm -hmm. we are reading the story of Silas. Paul, Paul and, and Silas. Silas in the prison. In the prison. Prison is not a good place. It's not a good place. It is not a good place. Uh, Boys yes. and girls, can we listen to teacher yes. Sam to tell us why prison is not a good place? It and they were in the prison. Those, those people in prison, yeah. uh, in prison they are so they are thieves in the prison. Thieves. Killers, they are put there. Those boys and girls who fight, sometimes they are put there. And for some, boys and girls, yes. they are arrested. Yes. They Even are. small children, yes. they go to prison. They can go to prison. So prison is not a good place. I'm shocked. Yes. Even boys are the girls. Yes. They are they prison are for children. Oh, yes. I did And know. they are kept there. And in the prison, you are put chains. You remain there. Are they beaten? They are. They are. Okay. So, boys and girls, praise the Lord. Praise the Lord again. Amen. My name is Uncle Sam. Wow. And I love you so much. Wow, welcome Uncle Sam. Thank you so much. Yes. Now, boys and girls, before I tell you the Bible story, one day, there was one boy in our school. The name of the boy was Kamau. <laughs> and Kamau was a good boy. Kamau uh, was so loving. Teachers and their parents and pupils loved him. Mm -hmm. But one day, there was another naughty boy in our class. That boy sometimes could steal other children's pencil. And do you know, one day, that boy took a pencil that belonged to a certain girl. And do you know what, Chamakena? Mm -hmm. The boy ran very fast and told that girl, it is Kamau who has stolen the, the pencil. Kamau was taken to the teacher. And Kamau started crying, telling teacher, teacher, I'm not the one who stole the, the pencil. pencil. 
That, but the girl was insisting. I'm told by the other boy, that naughty boy, you are the one. Come out, prayed to the teacher. He begged the teacher into you know what. After listening to that case, the teacher said, I know Kamau very well. He cannot take something that is not his. Do you know what? Another boy came say, and he said, I saw the root boy, that naughty boy, is the one who took the pencil and Aliona, where he hid the pencil. And do you know what, boys and girls? Kamau was raised by the teacher and he was told, Kamau, it is sorry. And that root boy was beaten and was punished. Wow. Yes, mm -hmm. he was punished. So when you trust God, you pray and you do the right thing, God will save, will save you in the situations that you cannot save yourself. Even when people lie about yes, you. Yes, God will speak on me wow. on, on the behalf of you, you, you are alive. Wow. Yes. Now, boys and girls, welcome again. Our Bible story today is from the book of Acts, chapter 16. Acts, chapter 16. From verse 16 downwards to 40. Wow. Yes. A long story. A long story. Paul in Cyrus, mm -hmm. in the prison. One day, Paul was preaching. And the Bible says there was a girl who had a spirit, a bad spirit. That girl in, or was every morning was going to beg some money somewhere along the streets. So, one day, she insisted and insisted and insisted, following Paul and Silas every day they were going to, to, to preach and to pray. But one day, Paul was like, no, enough is enough. He rebuked that spirit from that girl. And the parents and the family members, they were annoyed. They were annoyed and annoyed and annoyed. Do you know what they did? Because Paul and Silas were Jews, they started following them to the, uh, they, they, they took them, they tied them with the robes and they threw them in the streets. They, was, they were beaten, they were mocked, they were done everything. Until now, they were taken to the king of that town. Do you know what? The order came immediately that they should be put in prison. The Bible says what, boys and girls? When Paul and Silas were put in prison, their hands were tied by chains and their legs were put oh. in, or they were tied in chains and they were put in the middle of the prison of that prison. The Bible says around midnight that day, Paul and Silas started praying and singing. Praying and singing, boys and girls. While in the prison. While in the prison. They sang for their Lord good songs and praying. The Bible says immediately there was earthquake, very strong earthquake. And doors and the prison was shaken like this. Do you know what, boys and girls? The chains and the hooks, they all. They were what cut they off. Yes, they were cut off. And immediately, the prisoner who was standing at the door was now scared. scared and asking, what has happened? Do you know what? Because the prisoner saw what happened, he took a knife and he wanted to kill himself because he was fearing what the king will say. Paul and because Paul and Cyrus already the chains are cut off and they are now free. When he was about to kill himself, Paul told uh, Paul and Silas told him, "No, don't do that. We are here. We are here. We have not gone anywhere. We are here." He was he, he was very shocked. He started shaking and he was worried. What do I do? He went to them and asked them, "What what what, what has happened?" And now, do you know what that prison the, that's the, the prisoner who was guarding. The, 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 the door. The gate. He, the yes, he fell on their feet. feet. And from there, they started, he started, and he decided, I'll be serving the Lord, the God of Paul God and Silas. Wow. Yes. That amazing. They were released and they went home happily. A good story. Wow. Imagine the people of God 
they were arrested because of preaching the word of oh, God. Yes. They were put in the prison. Here comes the power of God yes. to, break, to make the doors open, mm -hmm. to cut off the Jeez. chains and everything from their legs and hands, and they were set free, free. in midnight because of praise and the worship, worship. and the, just saying, Hosanna, oh, our Lord who is oh, in yes. heavenly mm -hmm. places. Mm. Wow. wow, I love that. That's why I tell you, pray and read your Bible every day. Yes. You know when Paul and Silas prayed and sang the song to the Lord, it came back to them to save them. Imagine boys and girls, God will save you. God will save you. God will save, God us. Will save you. God, God will, will save all of us yes. when we trust in Him. Mm -hmm. Wow, this wow. is amazing. Mm. Our dear parents, we love you. Help us teach our children to trust in the Lord like Paul and the Silas in all things. Yes. God bless you. God bless we you. love you so, love so you. much. You are just amazing people. Mm -hmm. God is our victor. Our Bye -bye. victor. Bye. Wow. <laughs>